Because we heard that helicopters flying around and we didn't see what's going on. And we saw police came, we saw a big Honolulu Police Department truck. The only thing I saw is the SWAT teams and a bunch of cops. They're trying to make a plan for the for the for the guy to come out. But what I can say is that when I was coming from work and you know I went to go in because I saw some cops was was on the the roadside so I tried to go in for grab my, my my girlfriend but they said I couldn't go in. We begin with an update to breaking news we first brought to you Thursday night on Island News. Happening now on Oahu, an armed man still barricaded inside his Waianae home after reportedly being served an eviction notice. Now, according to police, the situation began Thursday afternoon, just after 2.30 in the 8500 block of Ala Walua Street. Sources say the man is armed with a bow and arrow and that he attempted to shoot at sheriffs who were serving the notice before barricading himself inside. This morning, crisis negotiations underway. HPD Specialized Services Division officers are still on scene. The public is asked to avoid this area. We've reached out to the Department of Education for the status of schools for the YNI students today, and we will bring you the latest on this developing situation throughout the morning. Honolulu police say the suspect injured one of its canines. You can see that in the video. An officer carrying the dog with his head wrapped in a bandage.